In this example video I'm going to get my whole general ledger structure from Exchequer. I'm going to copy some general ledger codes and create them just to show you how you can edit or maybe import a whole uh, general ledger structure. Okay, let's switch to Excel. Here I am in my custom and stock example spreadsheet that comes with Postrans. This time I'm on the tab Import GL Codes. On row 1 I've got a series of tags which um, Postrans uses to identify the Exchequer fields which is going to write to these columns within Excel. So to extract my general ledger structure I simply press Update Lookups. It's just warning me whether I want to overwrite the values that are already in the spreadsheet and I answer yes. You can see there it's now reading the uh, structure from Exchequer and it's now popped that into the spreadsheet. Now if I've got the professional version of Exchequer, sorry Post-Trans, then I can actually use lookups to help me edit this spreadsheet. But let's add, uh, say, a new code under depreciation. So I can just simply copy that row and pop it down here. Obviously it needs a new general ledger code, which is basically the ID of the code. As I say, if I had a professional version, I could actually change the heading so I could pop it in a different place within the general ledger. And I might want to call it um, depreciation of cleaning machines. So now I can simply post that back to Exchequer. And that's now popped uh, under depreciation a new general ledger code. So it's quite simple to um, add and amend and maybe design a whole general ledger structure within Excel and post it into Exchequer Enterprise.